Let's go. Yo, what's up, and welcome to Ngaku Gaming on some Black Ops 4. Yes, it's finally out. i actually been playing it. Um, I wouldn't say a lot because I've had work and other things going on. I couldn't play it as much as I would like to play it. But release night, I played it, and I played it that weekend, pretty much all weekend. I, I believe I at least got like 20 hours in right away. <laughs> there was one point, if you look through my videos and look through the stream, it was like I streamed like nine hours. I just kept on playing it. You know, my buddy young CEO joined me and we just kept just going in on people him and Sereno were just snapping the whole time but um, I got some gameplay for you in the background it's gonna be us playing some control I believe we won this one we did pretty good out using that vapor gun that's pretty much my main setup now vapor gun um, I don't have a particular specialist I like I'm just starting to get used to nomad with the dog I think they might nerf the dog because it's just it's pretty OP. I mean, he, he always gets a kill. Um, I think I think they did nerf him a little bit um, from after uh, release weekend. Uh, it seems like a little bit easier for people to kill him nowadays. But anyway, these are just my first thoughts. Um, since the beta, you can definitely tell it's a lot cleaner. Um, things are a lot smoother. There's a lot of a lot of less issues. Um, not to be honest, not that I ran into a lot of issues with the beta, but there was some gun issues here and there that ran to and some things we wanted like the cursor they act the cursor thing they fixed they allow you to go through the menus with the d-pad instead of the destiny 2 style cursor or destiny style cursor and i'm just going in right here but <laughs> but um they just they just gave a lot of fixed did a lot of quality of life improvements to the game it just feels really good it feels like it feels like to be honest um, what you want a Call of Duty to feel like. It's somewhere between, like, to be honest, I think it's between, like, Ghost and Black Ops 3. Because um, Ghost had that really high um, kill time that people hated. Like, you can just shoot somebody and melt them really fast. And this doesn't really have that. You do end up in more gunfights where you're going back and forth. But it's, it's one of those things where with the health being at 150, if someone aims at you and they have a good aim and they shoot first... And you might be able to dodge and weave and maybe kill them, but it's all about your aim. And so if your aim is off and they have a pretty good aim, they're most likely going to kill you because you don't reheal. You don't heal anymore. And that's the big change. So even if you're taking cover behind something, if you're not running that stem shot will let you shoot and heal at the same time, you're going to just have to heal, stick yourself and be waiting a second and then try to shoot. And, you know, it's not that fast. So if they got the upper hand they got a good aim on you, you're going to lose that gunfire. You're going to lose and have to <laughs> respond. And same with just um, major gunfights. Like if you're a rusher type player, you like to get into spawns and try to get three, four quad kills, this and that. That's, there's going to be a rarity with that. If you gain that, that means their whole team sucks <laughs> because it's all it's. It's, it's all about the health, like, because if they shoot you, you're not going to heal, and you're trying to kill three or four people, you're not going to heal unless you use your shot. And if you don't use the shot, um, you, you're going to, if they, if, if those three or four people have a good aim, they're for sure going to kill you. You, you, it's, there's nothing you can do because you're not going to auto heal, you're not going to be a dodge, dodge around the corner and heal, you, you're going to die. Again, if their team <laughs> just happens to have bad aim and can't hit you, you're gonna get you're gonna get that kill those four three or four kills, but it's gonna be a rarity because um, they they kind of brought like the the feeling from Overwatch where you uh, so it, it kind of gives that same feel from Overwatch. So in Overwatch, if you're not familiar, it's not about who gets the most kills all day unless you're playing like a TDM mode or something. But it's more team based in the fact that that every time me or you or someone else shoots somebody, if we both shoot them and then the third person comes along and kills them, all three of us get it. And Overwatch, they call it Eliminations. And Black Ops 4, they're calling it Enemy Killed in Action, E-K-I-A, Enemy Killed in Action. And so if I come if I come and shoot somebody and he does, dodges around the corner and I don't finish him off, if my teammate comes around the next other corner and kills him, 
it will count for me and him. So it's it's that feeling of, you know, you didn't waste your time. And it's not all about getting final blows. It's about working as a team to get those kills and to, you know, kill the team that's going against you and to get to the objective or do whatever you do to, me, to win whatever type of match it is. And that I think that's a really great feeling. You know, in past CODs, it was always about who got the final blow all the time. You know, if you ran around the corner and shoot two dudes and they just happen to bob and weave out of there and your teammate come around the other side and kills both of them, he gets the kill. And it was just like, okay, well, well I don't get nothing, you know. <laughs> I pretty much did, did that for nothing. And Black Ops 4 is not about that anymore. If, if you took your time to do that, to shoot somebody, um, you both get it. And you get points for it, and I totally jumped off right here. I didn't. I didn't know there was no land right there. <laughs> but, but um, other than that, the gun balance feels great. There's a lot of different types of guns. Um, most maps you're probably gonna want to run a assault rifle. You're gonna want to find a nice assault rifle. And this one I'm running is pretty good. It it doesn't slow you down too much, so you still got to get that kind of SMG feel. However, it has really good accuracy and really good long range. It doesn't uh, shake or anything too much when you're shooting. And it's called the Vapor. And then there's some other couple of guns. The first SMG is pretty pretty stable that you run with. I had some friends that like the GKS. I think it's GK5 or GKS. That gun is pretty good. I like the SOG. I don't remember if I got any new game play with it, but I remember playing with it quite a bit during the beta. And it shoots really fast it shoots a lot of bullets really fast uh, i can't remember if it's easy to control or not but but most of the guns are really good i mean if you find a gun you like if you're an smg player and you want to rush into tight corners you're gonna you're gonna find one same with the, uh with the assault rifles i didn't try any shotguns yet i'm not much of a shotgun type player but i did see some people running shotgun and they ran around the corner and pretty much one shot sometimes it might have been two shots i can't remember if I think there's a couple of two shot shotguns or two shots you're dead and there's one or two or there's one shot you're dead but I think you got to reload every time so not I, I didn't see any spammy shotguns that's gonna make the rushing t people mad not yet <laughs> other than that um, everything just feels good there's a lot of maps even um, if you get the basic version of the game I think you still got all 14 maps I think 15 maps I think in November you're getting we're getting black ops or <laughs> Black Ops. We're getting Nuketown November. So f 15 maps is huge. I can't remember any CODs that came out with that many maps all at once. Probably not for not for the last three or four years. Not for a long time. Probably an older one. But I think that's pretty awesome. I didn't play too much Blackout. I'm not a big fan of um, Battle Royale. I haven't played any Blackout since the beta. I only played Blackout during the beta because it was a Blackout specific beta and there was no option to play multiplayer. Otherwise, I probably would have played multiplayer because I just, I just don't like the one life game of Battle Royale. So I'm not sure if you'll see much of Battle Royale Blackout on my channel. So sorry about that. But I did get to mess around with zombies and I'm going to be posting some videos of that. There's a new mode in there called Rush Mode and I'm going to talk more about that in the videos. But I think Zombies this year is going to be pretty good. There's a lot of options and a lot of different things you can do with that. But I think that's it. I'm just going to let you enjoy the rest of this video. Like I said, gun balance is great. There's not too many glitches or issues that I notice. Um, if you, I, I would say if you if you have a team, probably try to play a team. Black Ops 4, I noticed, is much better with a team. I mean, every COD has been like that, but it's it's it's... It's just, it's night and day between any other COD. Because any of the other ones, you could run around and you you would auto heal and you could just do what you got to do to win the match and you'll get through. But this one, there's a clear difference. Like when, you work, when you're when you working with your team and they're running different types of characters and they're using them properly to help block off sections or help the team, help everyone that's playing with them, it just plays better. And... You'll see that in certain matches yeah. that I'll come yeah, out. Yeah, I know. I was, I was that's going it for in today. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed this video. Peace. Uh. Yeah, I can use this vapor. I like it. I'm about to try with try try them out. Look, it is like machine gun. I'm gonna set up a class with it. Damn. Damn, I already got the long barrel for it too. Oh, I'm gonna back yeah, out. that's that's what you need. Food. That's that's it. All right. Oh, 
Oh, you can get stock on? Oh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> this might be more good. Oh, I hope you enjoyed that video. Thanks so much for joining me. And if you did, go ahead and share with your friends. Like, subscribe if you didn't. Thumbs down. Give me a comment and tell me why you didn't like it so I can grow and improve. Until next time, peace.